what's good fam we back at it with another video shout out to Araco uh, TV for this one um uh, toxic woman steals man's phone and regret and instantly regrets it wow now i've seen this dude uh no fool gazy podcast i've seen a couple of his joints and uh he be checking some women some stuff i agree with that he be saying some stuff i don't but hey you know what i'm saying there's nothing wrong with that i still watch his stuff still to this day you know what i'm saying so yeah man let's jump straight into it y'all let's get it you got it, but I'm dead serious. I know you got this. Right, and he's right here. You are giving up. You are giving up your spirituality to a man that you really don't even want a true commitment from. You're 27 years old, right? You already got three kids, so it's like I was real shit. And she's laughing. I'm about to get mad, bro. bro at the end of the day, I don't play that shit. Like I really don't. She's like I'm disrespecting. We laughing at him. I feel like y'all disrespecting me now. We're not laughing. We're not laughing. We're laughing. We're laughing. We're laughing at what he's saying for the simple That's fact. That's dope. Few minutes later. My page is gonna be blocked. My page is gonna be blocked. What's up? What's up? Cause you're a liar. Cause you're a liar. Back up. Back up. Cause you're a liar. Back up. Back up. Look. See, yeah, the cops gonna see that. Got it. I didn't put my hand on him. I grabbed your phone. I grabbed your phone. I grabbed your phone. <laughs> you mad? You mad that you tried to fuck me? She wants you to hit her. Don't touch me. And the little piggy did in fact come to get her. A few moments later. Go ahead, you talk first. Do you talk to them out there? No. Yes. Go talk to them out there. Why? I was invited. It doesn't matter. I was invited. Well, asking me to leave. Looks like there's only one place you go in your little muppets. You go on a day. You go on a day. This is my wood miser LT40 wide hydraulic sawmill that I use daily to. Don't nobody give a damn about that sawmill. We see ass. Cut lumber and slabs that we sell here at our shop. Hmm. Well, this is my Kasori Turbo Blaze six quart air fryer, and I use it nightly to heat up chicken nuggets for my kids. <laughs> I sign up for Job Corps to go in the CNA program. I want to be an LPN, last instructor to the nurse. <laughs> she stands like this in every video, even when she's trimming her bush. What do you mean by that? Wow. I don't always trim my bush. I beg your pardon? But when I do, I use my steel MSA-60. This is a Thunder Nova 51 laser. Did you know, on average, it takes one year per inch to air dry lumber. This is a tote of firewood. Lady. These are sycamore logs. This entire pile of logs is monkey paws. This is a pecan log. Really? Do you call it a pecan, a pecan, or a pecan? Check this out. This is a tote of firewood. It should be Do you got jeans, sweatpants, something? Mandatory DNA testing at birth. No. I don't know why you, okay. Because I, it's for calling my wife off to do that. I mean, it's why? ridiculous. Why? Okay, so because the, the assumption of the, man, of the free, well, mandatory, good grief, but the, the uh, premise of it is that my wife is sleeping around. Okay, so, so I'm quite confident my wife is not sleeping the woman, around. The woman feels icky for a little bit, but then... The man you know, feels icky. I would feel but, quite icky. Hey, hey. The woman feels icky for a little bit. Fine, maybe the man feels icky. Certainly, but, 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 but it, okay. prevents, yeah. it prevents... Bruh, what? Dog, how? Men from being put on child support and raising kids that aren't theirs. You're saying and if people want to opt out of it, fine. Fine, you can opt okay. out. You so it's not mandatory. Out. But it's, a, it's voluntary. But there I, is voluntary. Uh, I, 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 I think it would be better if it was mandatory. I think that's a better... So then the men can't opt out. Oh my gosh, I, what are you... Uh, if you're with a woman that makes you feel that you need to get a DNA test when your child's born and you're not with the right woman, and you probably knew deep down that you should have never had a baby with that woman. No. You found it tough today? No, 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 no. She's pretty much saying it should be mandatory due to the fact that a lot of people be out here playing thinking that this man is the baby's father and he's not. They have plenty of women out here and you see it on paternity court in the whole nine where the fellas be be on child support. They go through so much shit and they never and they look up what five, six years later and they're not even the child's father. They got plenty of videos where they got a video where this guy was married to the chick and 11 years later he found out that he wasn't the father. It should, like, yeah, at the end of the day you should have a choice when it comes to it. 
They said it's mandatory, but if you want to opt out, that's your choice. But if you want to be secure and want to know, there's nothing wrong with you doing so. Very. Very, but I'm also not trying. I've been a serial monogamous for a while. I got out of a long-term, long-ish term relationship a few months ago. But yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult, but I also haven't tried. But I'm, I, I, don't, I don't know what I'm expecting. I haven't gone into the dating world in maybe six years. I've been in long-term relationships. She tried to get married twice and failed twice. I, I don't even know how she managed to get anybody to propose, to be honest. No man in his right mind is going to settle with a porn star. You've got to be... you got to have some sort of issue, like Adam22. Three guests on my podcast? Oh, my gosh. I mean, honestly, that's why I think about one of my exes. Oh? My other victim type, thanks for asking, is bald babes. And I don't gotta ask where they are because they're, they're always reflecting. Bobby, I noticed you when I came in. There was a big glare and I was like, what is that? And your, your Bobby friend behind you. We got two for one at this table. Three, where's the third one? He got, oh. No, you don't know what's under his hat. What's under your hat, bro? He's got hair. He's getting there, though. Give him a few years. I know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, but all I'm saying is you should see life from a woman's perspective. It's tough, you know. What are you doing? See it from a woman's perspective, you know. Look at the kitchen window. <laughs> oh, my God. That one there was a violation, trust me, I wouldn't Can I have you turn around for a second? A man who gives true meaning to the word redneck. Can you get up and turn around? There's the real meaning of a dumb bitch. Be cold. I'm quite literally rolling around in horse shit. Trying to get... Trying to get this, this bottom thing off my car. Mm, I don't want that medical. I'm gonna cry. I'm trying to get this off, and then you just, and you just screw it. I just, just wish someone would, would pull over and help me. I was so much just pulled over, no way. Thank you so much. I, I gotta say it, guys. This woman's reaction is how most independent women would react. You know, she might have got a little further if she just stopped recording herself crying for TikTok. We're living in a generation now where people pull out their phone to film themselves crying instead of pulling out their phone to look up what to do. Exactly. You've got so much information on your phone and you use it for shitty TikToks. Five million. Go to, go to YouTube and find out how to take it off. Like the hell you gonna go to TikTok for just to complain? It's still gonna be a problem there. Blind people in the <gasps> world right now. Let's make that zero. My bad. Talking about jet. I'm sorry. Did I say I saw them on them? Hold on. That zero. It's a shitty TikTok. Five million blind people in the world right now. Let's make that zero. We talking about genocide and I saw them on them. Love it. Let's do it. The boss is coming. <laughs> What do you look for in a man? Confidence. Me that. Yeah, me that. Nice smile. Me that. Yeah. Lux. Yeah, love. Love them. I actually do love them. Thanks. You have really nice teeth too. Good, because enough people here to brush them teeth. I like how your teeth are white. I don't know if it's a London thing. I've seen a lot of yellow teeth. It's a bit really? Like, you know, your teeth are just perfect. You know, I see myself in your teeth are right now. <laughs> people have been asking for me to go on this show, but the way he's got her smiling and giggling, I don't think she'll be back. Cause you know what they say. If you can make a girl laugh and you, <laughs> you can make that ass clap and jiggle. Indeed. Any reminder if you're not sleeping with multiple women, you're not missing out, bro. Papi, most men has fought because of this mother. It's the same. When you are judged based on your body count, basically the more bodies you have, the more powerful you are, the more awful you are, the more respect you get. Yeah, and it can also mean the more STDs you've got and the more child support you've got to pay. I think it's a much bigger flex having one good quality woman than it is having five hoes. Bro, this is all bullshit, motherfucker. Motherfuckers be even lying about their body counts because they want to be accepted in this society. Oh yeah, I got two of me, bitch. You only got two, you know that shit, boy. Bobby, the reality is that ego and society is killing you as a man, bro. You're wasting time, money, effort, and a good girl just because you want to 
Do I have to finish? Hey, why are you just sitting in the chair like that with your legs clocked open like that? What? That's our team, dog. Expo! Expo! Never wasted a man's time. Yeah. What's the longest time you wasted? Six months. You must be very proud of yourself. I think it's gotta let the hoes be honest, man. If that girl wanna go be a you let her go be a Just go take the hoe back after she finished. But if she wanna be a then don't try and save her. Let her do what she does best and leave her where she belongs. She belongs to the streets. Yeah. Straight up. <laughs> Let me put a homie in there. <laughs> yeah, because that whole video, he was speaking facts, man. <laughs> he was speaking facts, man. It's like, yo, it's, mm, you really got to watch who you bump uglies with man you gotta watch her you do the butt naked watutsi with out here man you know what i'm saying there's some folks out here don't clean right some folks out here got them got them had them had them stds and stuff man you gotta really really be careful out here man and uh also there's some crazy folks out here so some of y'all know y'all give somebody some of that good and they turn fucking out of this world straight jacket crazy for you <sighs> man but yeah this this mainly a society thing like the more women you you got the like that shit don't mean nothing honestly it really don't it really don't. Um, I still got. Never mind, I ain't gonna put my business out there like that. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. But yo, other than that, yeah, y'all be careful out here, man. Uh, but in the first video, it seemed like she wanted him to fight. And lo and God forbid, if he did put his hands on her, then she would have escalated it to something even more crazy. Keep your hands. To yourself. Keep your hands to yourself. That goes for both men and women. Keep your hands to yourself. Everything else will be cool. Unless it's for a life or death situation. If it ain't to that magnitude. Keep your hands to yourself. Well it don't have. Well if you're trying to defend yourself period. But yeah. I even seen a Neo video where his baby mother got all in his face like he wanted she wanted him to put a, his hand like Neo ain't do it. And honestly it's like so folks be like, I don't know if he did it, I don't know if he did, but I mean we'll find out not I ain't finding out nothing. I don't give a shit. To be honest. <laughs> but yo, if y'all like this one, man, shout out to Araco TV. Uh yeah, man, I did a series last time where he did when uh when when men stop simping over women. <laughs> I might go back to doing that. Y'all let me know down in the comment section if y'all want me to keep doing that, man. Uh, but yeah, man, if y'all like this video, smash the like button for your boy. Comment down below what y'all thought. Share the video and subscribe to the channel for your boy. Peace, love, blessings. We out this peace.